welcome to another Warby Camera Guy video. If you have a need to change the format of a video clip from a landscape into a portrait format, for example, perhaps you want to upload a video to TikTok, then I'm going to show you to this, and this is utilising HitFilm Express. Now, I make no claims for originality. There are plenty of videos out there on YouTube on this subject, but I think sometimes they don't always go into the detail that I think that you need. So hopefully from this, you'll be able to make your TikTok videos to suit. So let's get started. So in the timeline, I have a simple video clip here. And what I'd like to do is to change this into a portrait format. So the way we do this, you go into File, go into Project Settings. At the moment, it's set at 1080p and it's a, 90, a width of 1920 and a height of 1080. And what we actually need to do is completely reverse that. So I'll click that little table there. We'll now put 1080 as the width. Click that little symbol there to unlink those two, because if you don't, they just keep trying to change their scaling in a set ratio and you'll never do it. So we'll put 1920. Click a little symbol there and we can give it a name. I'm just going to call that new up. Click OK and click OK. So as you can see now, we've gone into a portrait format, but the video clip doesn't fill it top and bottom. So the way we make this happen, just click the little video clip, do a right click with your mouse, go into transform and go into fit to frame height. So you can see there now it's filled the actual frame to so, suit, but it's not quite sitting squarely. But what you can do, simply grab your mouse, click the left hand button, hold it down, and you can just move it to suit so you can get the best sort of um, view for your videos. That'll do nicely there. So if I play this clip, there's our little pup. What we need to do next now is to export it, but we need to set up a new export preset, but this is very easy. Simply click that little symbol there. We're going to add the video clip to the queue. So just click on the entire contents of the video clip. So as you can see now, it's in our uh, queue ready to be sort of exported, but we need to now create a new preset. So click on presets, click on new presets and click on MPEG4. We're going to give this a new name and I'm going to call it new pup preset. And as you can see, one of the items is on the scale mode, it says keep the aspect ratio. And what that means is it keeps the same ratio as the video that you're actually sort of trying to export. So in order to it'll keep that portrait format, click OK, click on to go back onto the queue, click that symbol again. And now what we're going to go is looking for a default preset and we're now looking for our new preset. There it is, click on that. Now do a right click. We're now going to start exporting and it will now start sort of exporting our video in the format that we want and the actual sort of um, location of the video you know there was the, the pups right sort of central there with the the video clip that we want so all doing well so far it's just about done that i'm now going to do a right click we're just going to reveal the output we'll play that and there you go there's our little pup and that's all there is to it. Hopefully this proved useful to yourself. If it is, then please pop across my channel. There are plenty of other little videos on HitFilm Express that perhaps may be useful to yourselves. And there's some other content there as well. So as always, appreciate you watching and I'll catch up with you soon.